Whoa, Victor, you can't just pop out of nowhere without a shirt. Please, no more. Oh my God. Hey, it's the Dice, and welcome back to some more Sims 4 Spin the Wheel. I'm going to be continuing off from the last episode where we are now divorced. We divorced, or not divorced, I guess we weren't married yet. But we broke up with Zorin and we are now single mom again. Also, right at the end of the last episode, if you didn't miss it, link is in the description. We ended up spinning to triple our household funds. And I know what you're thinking, the house looks the exact same. Well, I did spend it on a certain someone's room, little Lori. She aged up last episode and got the light academia like aesthetic that she had to adopt and I did her room and it's really giving like academia it's super cute and cozy it's actually not finished and yes this room cost me 8,000 simoleons but yeah it's kind of cute it's got a lot of books she's gonna be doing a bunch of reading and it's kind of cozy but it isn't like fully complete and you know what her room is good enough I need to focus on other places like the dining room or the living room or even like the the main master bedroom just anywhere else other than the kids bedroom i spend so much money on them but okay it is 4 a.m um how are you doing you are thirsty oh, we need someone to like drink from i guess i wonder if lily like the cool down with lily is done i'm gonna get you to teleport here and i'll wake lily up just so we can have a look i didn't realize it last episode but she got struck by lightning <laughs> but okay uh Coleman is it possible for you to drink okay yeah compel for a deep drink so you go ahead and do that also last episode Paris aged up and I gave her some cc she looks cute oh my gosh Coleman thinks that she's attractive but they have bad compatibility which isn't great but yeah aged up Paris she looks super cute and actually Cadence has her birthday today. So I'm thinking we invite over the family, throw a small birthday party, age her up. She's still our child. So I will spin the aesthetics wheel for her. But yeah, we can have a little birthday party for her later in the episode. I did give Cody some CC because he did age up. So he's a whole child now. All the kids are getting older. But okay, Coleman, you hurry up and finish that and then come and teleport down here. You know what? Maybe I will give you the, what's it called? The bat power. So you can like go up and down places. So why don't you fly here as a bat? So it just makes more sense. Instead of me teleporting you everywhere. There we go. Okay, go shower and get ready for school. Laurie, you're doing well. You've got school soon too. I think you're just talking to your mom. How are the twins? Yes, the twins. Oh, you stink. Okay, we need to look after you right now. Why don't you ask your mom for a bath and you, you're doing pretty good. You do need some sleep. So why don't you come up here and get some rest? Do we have work today? Yeah, we have work at 12 p.m. So we've got to get some rest before then. I'm going to open the vet clinic. Hopefully Julia does her thing. She made like, what, 700 simoleons last episode. That was really good. But okay, Layla, you go and get some sleep so you're ready for work. You're sleeping. You also need some rest. So go to bed. Someone stayed up for 24 hours straight. I don't know who that is. Probably flipping Lily. Oh my gosh, Coleman's got like the blazer outfit on. He looks so adorable. And look at the red lights coming from his bedroom. It looks like he's doing some demonic activity in there. Since Lori has the whole light academia aesthetic, I feel like she would try really hard at school. So I'm going to get her to do some homework. And you know what? It's been a while since I spun the wheel right at the beginning of an episode. So let me do that. Let's see what antics we're getting up to in this episode. I wonder if it's going to be like super intense or not. <gasps> oh, okay. We get to change our aspiration. That's good because I'm not a massive fan of the eco aspiration we currently have. Okay, I've got the aspirations wheel up. Let's see what we're changing our aspiration to. I'm hoping it's something like kind of easy. <gasps> no freaking way that's literally like <laughs> that's literally perfect for us the beach aspiration we live in sulani we are a mermaid and now we are changing our aspiration to the beach one beach life so this will be our second aspiration in the location like section okay you know what maybe we can like even complete this because it's pretty easy get a suntan and gold on a carver party you know what we will turn cadence's birthday into a carver party i think that could be nice and now the kids are heading off to school 
Um, Coleman, I'm actually going to get you to make some friends so we can find you a girlfriend or boyfriend and get you to break up with them. And I might do the same for Lori. Oh look, she's thinking about books. Get her into school so she could potentially find a lover. So they're both on the hunt for like a romantic partner, which I think is pretty cool. Ooh, Erin Thought. Layla's getting Erin Thoughts, guys. Dating is a chaotic mess these days. No one seems to be taking it seriously. Not even Layla. That is so true. She really isn't taking her love life seriously. But maybe it's time to get serious about it and about looking for a relationship. It was all fine just dating around in one's teens and right after high school, but Layla feels like she's getting to a place where a relationship starts to sound more appealing. Should Layla enter a long-term relationship? You just got out of an engagement. That's how you know she didn't take it seriously. And now she's thinking about getting into a long-term relationship. I'm definitely gonna keep this in mind. And ooh, Laurie met Irvin at school. Interesting. Evan looks cool. Okay, you finish uh, bathing Tyler, not Tyler, Jacob. Let's get you to go to sleep. You are awake. You're a little hungry. Um, We made food yesterday, so I'm just gonna bring it upstairs for you. Oh, and we have work in an hour or half an hour. Oh, Coleman met Evie. <gasps> okay, you guys are making a lot of friends. For Laurie, I'm gonna get her to study hard now because we wanna get her... Oh my gosh, why is your performance only okay? What is up with that game? Okay, we definitely need to work harder in terms of your school work. But Layla, you have now got work. Go and earn us some money because we are, we don't have much right now. Oh, Coleman also met Elsa. Okay, Coleman's making a lot of friends. Maybe Coleman should like host a party or something, like a high school party. He did get a tattoo last episode on his chest insane i don't know maybe we should make a bunch of rebellious friends like a like a club or something okay layla is catering a huge party for a prominent client i feel like we've gotten this pop-up before um we're just gonna oh wait we need to spin we've got to spin this i totally forgot this is a thing that we do in this challenge but okay we're gonna go with option two apparently okay please let this be good and that didn't like hurt our reputation or anything or give us a boost which is fine Coleman met Atlas. Oh my gosh, Coleman, you're so popular. Oh, he's really bored. Principal speech from a school event. Maybe keeping the money would have been best after all. Damn, Coleman, is that how you feel? Oh, who's calling you? Why is the principal calling you? During lunch period, the high schoolers work together to get some homework done. Nice. My principal called to say that my school performance is pretty shaky. What? If I'm not careful, I could drop a grade. I was told to focus on my school goals, keep a good mood at school, and make it in on time every day. Oh my gosh. What are you up to at school? Are you being rebellious? Look at your performance. Okay. Well, let's get you inside because you are burning. Go inside, stay in the cool, please. I mean, why don't you invite some of your new friends? Should we get into a relationship with Paris? Because if we're gonna complete our aspiration, we've gotta like break up couples and achieve X status with a bunch of Sims get caught cheating. We've got to do a lot of like stuff like that. Or Paris could end up being end game, potentially, if there is an end game for Coleman. Let's invite over one of these girls that we met today. Oh yeah, and today is going to be Cadence's birthday, which what time does Layla finish work? Five. So I'm gonna plan the Carver party for... Oh wait, I should plan it as Layla. Oh, and Elsa's gonna be right over. Okay, that's fun. What are you listening to? Alternative. Okay, good choice. Laurie's gone straight to bed. School knocked her out. Why don't you wake up, go and pee, take a shower, and then get some homework done. Oh my gosh, Dandelion is in such poor condition. Coleman can't like look after her because it's still sun out. So Laurie, oh, Laurie's like busy. We might have to like hire a ranch hand for our one horse. Oh, but we don't have the money. Okay, maybe not. Oh, and Elsa's here. Let's go and say, hey, I'm gonna add her into a group. Maybe she can hang out until the carver party. Why don't you guys come downstairs and watch a romantic movie together? Oh my gosh, and Layla has gotten prom has she got no she didn't get promoted i lied she did bring home some money who's calling you coleman coleman's not even at school okay well while you're home let's plan the carver party at event we are doing where is it carver party it's gonna be gold we are gonna be the host and guests uh we're gonna invite caleb we're gonna invite jacob oh not carlos because we don't know carlos well we do but like we're not having any contact with him 
Common, Cody, um, who else? Who are all these random kids? Lori, Tyrone, Cadence, who's, whose birthday it is. Should we invite Victor? I mean, we can, Victor and Paris. Do you even know Paris? I don't think you know Paris. I'll invite her through Coleman. Okay, so these are the people coming and then we're gonna do it here and we're gonna start it at six. So first we actually need, oh my gosh, Caleb's just here. Okay, hi, come on in. But yeah, first we need one of those carver pots the bowl there we go i'm gonna put that over here okay now we have everything we need to have a successful carver party now you go and invite caleb in and why don't you go take a shower you two are hanging out on the sofa this is so awkward your mum has just walked in your mum and dad just walked in you are crying well luckily your dad's here why don't you ask him to play and then ask him to give you a bath and go to bed oh and the cover party's starting already okay that was so quick well oh, i didn't realize how tired you were this isn't good Oh yeah, and the vet clinic's been open for 13 hours. Oh my gosh, Julia is doing bits. She made 1,283 simoleons. Wow, that's so impressive. Okay, well, Layla, we've got to get gold in this Carver party event. So why don't you go and prepare Carver? We also need to make a birthday cake for our daughter. So why don't you bake a strawberry cake? Lily's getting pop-ups, honestly, couldn't care less. Oh, and Caleb's come to chat. Yeah, you guys are on a really good level right now, which is good. Lori, since you're not doing anything, can you go and sort out um, Dandelion? Can you just brush her and clean her hooves? Oh, and the birthday girl's here. Are you excited, Cadence? She doesn't look very excited. But it's your birthday. Where is your brother? Where is Cody? I haven't seen him in live mode. Oh my gosh, and look at Coleman rising up. Like, what's your name? Elsa. I mean, we can go in with a couple of flirts. I feel like she would like that. Not very appropriate at your younger sister's birthday, but you know what? Is what it is. Oh, and they have romance. Oh my gosh, that was so quick. Maybe he's just got that ultimate game. Oh my gosh, your vampire teeth is on your everyday outfit. I didn't even realize. Oh, Coleman, you're making serious moves over here while your whole family's in the kitchen. Okay, oh yeah, you need to invite uh, Paris over. So you do that. And is the carver done? Let's invite, oh no, she's passed out. Okay. Oh my gosh, Cody, you look so cute. Oh my gosh, the blonde hair and the gray eyes, deadly combo. Layla, why don't you go and pee before you pee yourself? What are you doing down here? You're hungry? Go and ask your dad for some food, okay? I don't think Layla ended up doing the cake. I don't think it's in the oven either. Okay, well, first we're gonna invite guests to drink kava. So call to grab drink. And then we're gonna go ahead and make that strawberry cake for Cadence. Okay, this is going pretty well. The kids are having a good time joking around together. Oh, and the cake is finished. We've got to make a kava toast. So I'm gonna try and do that before we age up Cadence. Let me just quickly add some birthday candles. And then we're gonna drink, I think this is how you do it, right? You drink a cup of kava or any drink. And then if you click on your sim, you should get the option to make a toast. Nope. What if you click on the drink? No. Okay, how do you make a kava toast? With a cup of kava in hand, select another sim. Oh, you have to select another sim, okay. Victor, we're doing a carver toast. Okay, the option isn't appearing. Maybe we need to like wait a little bit for the action to appear. I don't know, I'm not seeing it anywhere. Game, don't do this to me. Where is the carver toast option? Because I'm not seeing it. Oh my gosh, support Laurie's acne. Not sure, support Laurie's acne. She's probably a little insecure about it. Oh, did she not like that support? Oh my gosh, she didn't like the support. Okay. Oh my, why are you yelling at her? Because she didn't like the support? Layla, that's not nice. Okay, I'm not getting the option to make a carver toast and I don't want that to be the reason. Oh, let's do a smooth apology. I don't want that to be the reason why we don't complete um the dinner party, like get it to gold. So I'm gonna cheat it because the game doesn't want to acknowledge that. Okay, we've got to invite guests to drink carver again. Okay. Okay, let's call everyone to grab a cup. And the party's almost over, so quickly, quickly. Oh wait, we didn't get gold. Oh, damn it, we got silver, okay. Is what it is. Let's get Cadence to, oh wait, how do we do this? Make wish, clean up. Is it not this, or is age up? Age up, 
children let's get cadence to blow out the candles is she actually gonna blow it out or is she just gonna like jump and age up oh no i think she's coming to blow it out yeah oh wait no she's not she's going outside where are you going oh she didn't even blow out the candles okay well, she aged up. Um, interesting choice of attire. I have no clue what her aspiration is. We will find out once we're in cast. But okay, let's randomize her aesthetic and see what aesthetic she's going to adopt. If you couldn't tell, I've added a bunch new aesthetics onto the wheel. I did a little bit of research and just added some ones that I wasn't like, I didn't know much about, like Coastal Grandma. Didn't know that was an aesthetic, but apparently it is. I've added some unique ones just to add a little bit of flair. There's a little difference to the wheel. And, ooh, Cadence is adopting the skater aesthetic. Okay, I'm having a look for some inspiration of like how to dress her. I'm seeing beanies and like some long sleeve. Sometimes they wear shorts, vans, of course. Okay, I'm looking at the guys' outfits as well. Their outfits are nice. We've got like, this guy's wearing a sweater vest and like baggy pants. Okay, I'm getting the vibe. I think I've got a good idea of like what to do. Okay, Cadence is officially one of my favorite sims ever. Like, she looks so cute. I gave her this, like, short haircut with, what's this called? Highlights. Little highlights in her hair. I think she looks so cool. She's got the piercings, the AirPods, the fanny pack, the baggy jeans, the vans. Like, she's ready to go skating. I wish we had skateboards in this game. That would be so cool. Okay, everyone's on their way out. It's 12 a.m. How's everyone feeling? You need to feed again. Okay, you know what? You're a neat sim. Why don't you do a cleaning frenzy? We really need a constant source of plasma because we get hungry all the time. Layla is still really tired. Why don't you go to sleep? And then we've got Laurie who's also really tired did you do your homework you did you can go to bed how are the twins oh my gosh everyone's just so tired you go to sleep you need a shower is your dad still here <gasps> no he's not okay um well no one's really around to help you out why are you bugging out let me just reset you a little stink didn't hurt anyone why don't you go and look at stuff go and play in the bin sure oh my gosh paris what are you doing why are you not leaving um Coleman, can you come and ask paris to leave oh you know what why do you talk to paris see how she's doing you guys don't have the best friendship and maybe this could be an enemies to lovers situation oh my gosh elsa's still here oh she is okay that's perfect we can actually make it official with her but first let's talk to paris you know we've known her since we were kids so she gets the priority look how pretty her makeup is it's so cute and her outfit is just adorable like i want this in real life she's kind of like the opposite of coleman like she's super bright and pastel and Coleman's super like dull and, and just wearing black. The only thing that has some sort of like brightness is his eyelashes. <laughs> oh no, you really stink. Okay, Coleman, we're gonna have to get you on big brother responsibilities and get you to bathe your younger brother. We're gonna have to put the hooker on the side and get you to sort out, who's this, Jacob. There we go, big brother responsibilities, looking after the younger sibling, how cute. Okay, Elsa, you're gonna have to be my victim for tonight because we're really hungry. Let's compel you for a deep drink. Once we finish bathing you, I think you guys can stop. You're a little hungry, so I'm gonna get out some food for you. Let's get this one out. No one go into the fashion studio because something is going down, okay? And she stinks as well. She Maybe we should just get her to go home. And Coleman is being a gentleman. He is saying thank you to Elsa for her delicious plasma, which is cool. Okay, why don't you take a shower in the twins' like ensuite? And then maybe, I don't think you would care about doing homework. Maybe we'll just wait for Elsa to wake up. Now it is Friday, I wanna do a, another spin. Since the last spin we did was change aspiration, I'm ready to do another spin. Please, no more! Oh my god. Okay, the wheel has spoken. We are having another set of twins. Who are we having these twins with? I don't know. Why do we have to have more children? Children. I'm sick and tired of the kids. Okay, I'm sick and tired of having children. Speaking of children, today is Friday, so Cadence and Cody are staying over for the weekend. 
They don't have a bed in their room. I should probably sort that out. We do have some decent money from the vet clinic. You know what, we're opening it up again, 6 a.m. open time. But okay, we've gotta have twins. Who are we having twins with? We could have twins with someone new. I could randomize it. Mm, should I, you know what, I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put on the wheel, have twins with Victor, Caleb, Zorin, or someone new. So four options. Okay, let's see who we are having twins with. I actually don't know who I want. Oh! <gasps> Victor oh my gosh we are rekindling our relationship with Victor okay <laughs> we're definitely not making Coleman and Paris flirt then because that would be so weird so that's interesting Victor we will be inviting you round at some point damn we woohooed with Caleb yesterday woohooing with Victor today we are just a mess <laughs> All right, but I'm gonna let you get your sleep. You've got work today in six hours. I really want this promotion. We should probably do some like cooking to help with our cooking skill. You are just here, what are you gonna do? Clean out spoiled food. Can you like remove candles and get rid of this cake? Oh my gosh, this place is a mess. Yeah, I need you to do another cleaning frenzy because we need this place. <gasps> Oh my gosh, he's so excited as well. But yeah, we need this place spotless. And you guys have school in an hour. Laurie, why don't you wake up and go and pee? Maybe do some reading. I think that could be nice. Read in your like a library. Oh no, study for your exam. You've literally got a library of books here. All right, kids, you guys are off to school. I think I solved the front door issue where they wouldn't use it. When I was rebuilding the place, there was like a plant stuck underneath the stairs. I have a feeling that's the reason why they couldn't go down but okay you guys are off Laurie why don't you study hard Coleman you just keep making friends potential suitors Layla I'm gonna wake you up and get you to make some food you know what? first invite over Victor and then why don't you serve some breakfast let's make some pancakes kids you are so tired why are you not going to bed Go to sleep. You guys are taken care of. Good. When do you guys age up? You guys have two days until your children. That's so soon. Oh, Coleman's already meeting people. Lamar. Yeah, it is the weekend. Maybe we should host a party. I think that could be fun. Oh my gosh. And today's Layla's birthday. I didn't even realize. Well, that's going to be paused because we're going to get pregnant. And then we're going to be pregnant for three days. So we're not technically aging up today. Once we do become an adult, I do want to like update Layla's look. We haven't spun to change it yet, but I think she definitely needs an update. We've seen her with the same hair and same outfits since episode one. And maybe I can do an update to her mermaid form as well because I did download a lot of new mermaid CC recently. So I'm kind of excited to use it. Okay, breakfast is being made. Whoa, Victor, you can't just pop out of nowhere without a shirt. Like you can't do that. It's a weakness. Oh, and today's, oh no, that's tomorrow. Tomorrow's family game night. Well, luckily we're gonna have the whole fam around so we can maybe celebrate it. Okay, why don't you grab a serving? Do any of you guys need food? Why are you not going to bed? Go to sleep. You are really, really tired. So grab a serving. And Layla, I need you to focus your charm on Victor. You know what? We're using the charmer's lullaby. Since Victor is human, oh my gosh, I can't look at you without a shirt. <laughs> You're a weakness to me, Victor. But yeah, since Victor is human, the Charmer's lullaby should work. What are you doing here? Elsa, have you been here all night? Go away. <laughs> okay, Victor is feeling a little uncomfortable and we do have work in an hour. I don't think we're gonna get pregnant in that time. Well, I'll try. We can rekindle our romance. Let's try and do a flirt. Oh, he's feeling good again. Oh, he's uncomfortable. It's been a while since we flirted with Victor. Like it's been Caleb, Caleb, Caleb but we're getting a little bit of Victor this episode and he will be the first person other than Caleb for us to have a baby with. So that's actually quite interesting. Layla, I know you need fun and this will be such an easy way for you to get fun. Let's just quickly get this romance up. Oh, and Layla's starting to feel like an expert at flirting these days. At heart, she just might be a true romantic, 100%. So now we've got the romantic tray. Oh, and you're going to work, okay. Well, no, don't skip work um what's going on we can get you pregnant once you get back how are you guys doing you're just tired 
just go to sleep why can't you use the bed you are fully fed and also tired you can also go to sleep lily couldn't care less about you love you do you do you oh coleman's met olive olive seems cool okay well that's fun it is the weekend so you're gonna be able to hang out with all these people we should probably get like a bed oh did you meet someone else nanny okay that's fun you guys got below average grades how especially laurie laurie's so good like she's been doing her homework she's been studying how are you not doing that great i don't get it but okay it's the weekend you guys are home i should probably get beds for cadence and Cody, make this place look a little nicer okay this one is for cadence and this one is for Cody. we only have four simoleons in our account right now but we still do have the business fund now i'm gonna use lori to sort this out let's do a stay over with cadence and Cody for three nights Okay, and they're coming over for the weekend. Oh, and you two are hugging. That's so sweet. I love how close all of the siblings are. Like, we don't have a sibling rivalry yet. We could potentially have one in the future, especially as we're getting twins. Look at you guys teasing each other. So cute. And you're both really tense. Um, Do you guys want to put on some music and then you can all dance? We'll put on some alternative. Oh, Cody's here. Let's go and talk to him see how he's doing i'll put your little suitcase next to your bed oh and it's green it's a little cow plant but yeah you guys can have a little dance party amongst yourselves oh cadence is here cadence just looks so cool oh she's sad coleman go and see what's up with cadence why is she sad oh they're all so close i'm so happy coleman let's invite over oh my gosh wait no coleman forget it because mom's home she is promoted she's been promoted to sue chef Oh my gosh, that's huge. Huge bonus. We've got a bunch of money. Now we've got to reach level six gourmet cooking. Okay, so we've got to do that. But for right now, we are trying to get pregnant. Let's invite over Victor and get this started. And you can invite over Elsa so you can like get in a relationship or something. Oh my gosh, Victor knows exactly why we invited him over. He's already heading upstairs. Let's go ahead and kiss his hands and just get him in a flirty mood. Oh, and Elsa's here. You go and be super cute with Elsa. Oh my gosh, should we invite her to prom? Mm, I feel like Coleman wouldn't. So we've got two Sims pursuing relationships. Oh my gosh, Elsa wasn't feeling it. Oh, I wish we could do like a vampire like romance thing. I think that's a thing we can unlock. That would be perfect for Coleman. Oh, but they made up. Okay. She still got the bite mark on her neck. You stop walking away. Go and like get the show on the road. Oh, we're ready. Okay. Well, why don't we do it in the shower since you need a shower? Try for baby with Victor. I can't believe this is happening. We've also got to spin what gender each baby will be because I need to cheat that we get twins. So we will definitely be doing that in a second. Once it's been confirmed that we're pregnant. I can't believe we're gonna have a baby with Victor. Like, I actually didn't think we would ever have a baby with anyone other than Caleb because we have so many of his kids. But okay, you guys are on it. Well, have fun. Lily is literally up in the tower and we are like doing this with her husband. We should probably convince Victor to leave her, right? Or maybe Coleman can do that as a part of his aspiration. Do you even know Victor? You don't know Victor. You should probably introduce yourself because you guys are about to become family. Layla, once you've had your shower, let's take a pregnancy test. Oh, and let's also close the vet clinic. 1,195 simoleons. Julia, you're doing bits. We did go down half a star, which we do need to visit. Um, our next day off is Tuesday and Wednesday. So we've got a while till we can go to the vet clinic. I do want to get the star rating up and also get the perk points too. That's pretty important. But okay, moment of truth. What are we having? Are we are we pregnant? That's the question. Are we pregnant, Layla? Are we not? Oh, we are! Oh my gosh! <gasps> We're pregnant again! Yay! Okay, let's see what gender these kids are going to be. So first, I kind of want a girl. It's been a while since we've had a girl. Oh my gosh, we're having a girl. Yes. Okay, so that's the first gender. And are we having like two girls or is it going to be girl boy? We're having two girls. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, let's go into MC Command Center. Um, NC pregnancy. Oh, you are going to have two males. Well, we're doing the opposite. Two females, zero males. 
Let's go. We are pregnant with two female babies. Let's go and share the big news with Victor. Where is he? Why is like a bunch of you in the toilet? And why do you stink so bad? Okay, let's get your big sis cadence to give you a bath. You need to find, why is everyone just outside? <laughs> okay, this is, this is kind of funny. Can we share the big news? Where would that be? <gasps> share big news. Yeah, let's tell Victor all about our pregnancy. We are having a baby. We should probably share the big news with the family as well. Should we go? like out to eat like to a restaurant or something and share the big news okay i think we're sharing it right now in front of everyone coleman does not look happy about it though i don't think he wants any more siblings which is so understandable oh my gosh are you supposed to be at work right now did you just get promoted oh my gosh we're like super late for work okay go to work you're already pregnant you're about to cook some dinner for everyone but just go to work oh i haven't even thought about it where are we gonna put the nursery and stuff oh my gosh i'm gonna have to plan this out are we gonna have to make this the nursery but this is the spare bedroom oh my gosh look at cody in the vampire layer i'm gonna have to like remap the house a little bit i might have to get the two sets of twins to share a bedroom that's not a bad idea i don't know we'll see but I'm kind of in the mood for another spin. I'm really hoping for something that isn't like super huge because uh, it's the end of the, it's getting to the end of the video. I don't want anything crazy. <gasps> Ooh, level up in celebrity status. That's kind of fun. Well, I'm going to be starting the beginning of next episode with that task, getting our celebrity status up. That's kind of interesting. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next video.